<laughs> it's Brendan and Oscar. Yes, and the Kirby goes to. I yes. believe you've seen us on Hinge. Yes. Oh. You know, Jimmy Kimmel will be great, but I'm just saying. I know. I I'm know. just yeah. saying. Kimmel, you yeah. know. This is Kimmel's fourth. Maybe you can do it next time. If you Kimmel drops out next year. Hat, right? Kimmel drops out next year. I, 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 hat. I think Jim, uh, Pretty Jim, good joke writer. I think, Jimmy, saying, I think Jimmy will do a good job. He will. He, he will. will do a, he will do He's going to do a great job. And I love it should looking, be a lot of fun. And, I'm looking, and I'm looking forward to it as well. I like the ideas. You know, they're, it's very creative, and that's what I love right, to do right. as well. So mm -hmm. Break out your tuxedo, and we'll talk about it again <laughs> on Monday morning. Okay, so this is big. Forbes has released its list of the highest paid actors of 2023. The number one spot goes to everybody loves him. He's, everybody says he's, he's great amazing. Guy, Adam Sandler, who brought in seventy-three <laughs> million dollars. Now that is fourteen million more than, and I do love her. I'm a very, very big fan. Margot Robbie, who ranks second on the list. That's right. So the number also includes money paid to Sandler's manager, lawyer, and agent. Meanwhile, much of Robbie's fifty-nine million in earnings came from the blockbuster Barbie, which brought in almost one point five billion wow. billion dollars at the global box office. Barbie co-star Ryan Gosling also made the list in a tie for fourth place with Matt Damon at forty-three million dollars. Boy, I hope after they're done paying their lawyers and managers, they have enough for themselves. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> Look, that's a, oh, lot, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money, that's but it deserved. That's a lot deserved. of money. It didn't work out with Margot and me because of the money. That's okay, yeah, that's money, right? You know, she's Barbie. I'm just, I'm just Brent. You're just yes. Brent. You're just not Ken. It's, you, you, you see that money, and it's, 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 it really is. It's just crazy when you see that money, and oh. then... People love Adam Sandler. Everybody says he's, he's, a, he's, a, he's, he's a, amazing. He's, he's a I mean, great he's guy. Unbelievable. You know, he's been Com a lot of comments. Oh, like you know. Right? <laughs> no, I know. I'm only kidding. Yes. I'm only kidding. <laughs> you, you got gossip no, you want to share with us? You want to tell somebody? Oh. Everyone loves it. You're absolutely right. We're going to cry. I like, I like Margot Robbie more. But that's just me. <laughs> that's just Will. That's just me. <laughs> that's just Will. That's just me. We're going to quiet the, quiet the Oscar right. talk and then the money down now because this week went by way too fast for us. So we not only announced the first nominee to our Remarkable Women contest, but also started what's in your fridge contest as well. And we welcomed an author, young leader, and chefs from all over the state as well. Let's take a look at some of our favorite moments <laughs> with this week's Roadshow Rewind. <laughs> what, better, what a better way to start the week off, right? Acting in a raucous and rowdy right. manner. It's too much. We want to educate people. <laughs> we want them to know all about the noggin. <laughs> on the heat, off the heat, on the heat. <laughs> Yeah, right here. What's happening up here? You know what I mean? I don't know. There's a lot going on in this noggin. Now, many people have icks. Let's make some noise for baked potato fries, everybody. <laughs> but everybody has food turn off. Let's hear it for curly fries. There it is. That's what I'm saying. You stink. Yes. Where's Benny's? I came up with this. It is the Roadshow logo created in cheese doodles. Anyway, I've got that out of my system Thank now. You. It was a guy climbing on a megalith. The Hamilton House mission is to provide stimulating interaction with their ideas. When I told this fellow that this was a portal to another dimension, he got off of it and said, no, no, this can't be happening. And we would like to make you a special <laughs> honorary member. Thank you so much. That's so awesome. I got to serve as a liaison from Rhode Island to the United Nations. We are sharing the first of four finalists for Nexstar's Nationwide Woman of the Year Award. I'm just planning to make sure I get everyone's voices heard. So we've joined our superpowers together again. Even when I was young, I always like to give and help people. We're going to give a, a, a beautiful fridge away. A beautiful fridge. The sun has not been shining in, in a few days. You need to have something like this to look at the eclipse. I wore my bright yellow <laughs> neon. Yes. Can't yes. miss me from a mile away. So what is it? I kind of just want like this beautiful spring day. Right, I, I want too. birds to come to our uh, hands. I'm told we also uh, need to put these on if we're going to look at Audrey's sweater. <laughs> you want to look at Disney movie. Like, <laughs> they were going crazy for it in the first segment. They're going even crazy. Crazy for it now. You want to be like Snow White. I want to be Snow White. You want to be Snow White. Stick a fork in it, Will. It's Meal done. Stick. It's all fun. Enjoy. Uh, all right. Enjoy. Come back for seconds anytime. No, no, no. It's not work. It's just all fun, and, and I, I love doing it. Oh, oh, come on. Thanks I love a good Snow White. Thanks, everybody, for joining us on the road show. Brought to you by Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses, Duncan, and the Comedy Connection. For more information on anything you've seen on the show, just head to roadshow.com. That's your line. That's your line, buddy. See you Monday. <laughs>